Hi guys, we have the three little pigs tonight with the star Lily as the big bad wolf. All right, let's come around here so Lily can see it. <coughs> the three little piggies. Once Mom, there was the three little pigs. They lived happily with their mother and father until the day they came that they had to make their own way in the world. Goodbye, goodbye, bye mom. Bye mommy pig and daddy pig. Oh, there's the three little pigs. We'll call you as soon as we can. They hadn't gone far when the three little pigs decided to stop for a picnic. Where are you going to live? The little pig, girl pig asked her brothers. Mm. Move, Lily. The big bad wolf. I know. You're the big bad wolf. Then one of the little boy pigs saw a farmer with a cartload of straw. We have straws. Close enough. Perfect house building materials, said the little pig. And he bought the whole load. All right, Lily, get ready. All right. Which piggy we should use this one? All right. Well, she built put the house of in, straw. Put it in Hold here. on. The little pig soon built a house of straw. Suddenly, he heard a voice outside. Let me in, little pig. It was a hungry wolf. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, replied the little pig. <laughs> then I will huff and I will puff and I will blow your host down. Then the big, the wolf blew down the host of straw, but the little pig managed to escape. Blow down the host, Lily. Blow it down. Harder, harder. Here, let's just wreck it a little bit. Wreck it down. Blow it and wreck it. Oh, wreck it. Come on, wreck it, wreck it, wreck it. Oh, oh. All right, we'll get them ready for the next one. <laughs> you need to do a little bit better blowing down that house. <gasps> All right, let's go back over here. The two other pigs carried on their way until they met a woman with a huge load of sticks. The second little boy pig bought the sticks. Brought, <laughs> he bought the sticks and built a house. <gasps> the house right there. Ooh, there he is. Then along came the big bad wolf. He knocked on the door of the stick house. Let me in, pig. Let me in. By the second little pig said, but the second little pig said, not by the hair of my tinny tin tin. <laughs> then I will, what does he do? Huff. And then he will puff. And then I will blow down your house. As the house of sticks was blown down, sticks flew everywhere, hitting the wolf in the head. Whoa, boof. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the crazy little wolf. The second little pig made his getaway, and he ran as fast as he could to his big sister's house. All right, two piggies need to run. Yeah, we're just going to keep them out front for the second. Inside. Now, the little girl pig had bought a load of bricks and, and set about the building <laughs> a strong, sturdy house. She worked very hard, and soon the house was ready. The little pigs was very pleased with herself. Home sweet home. Look at that chili. Good work. The third little pig settled into her new home, but soon there was a knock on the door. It was her brother's. Bang, 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 bang. The boy pig told their sister about the big bad wolf. Together they came with a plan. Lily, can you put them inside the house? Open the door. Put them inside. They need to get inside for the next trip. Hold on. Hold on, little man. I'm going to go. Oh, you want to be in this too. All right. See, you can be a bit of a little bad wolf too. All right. Soon there was another knock at the door. Can you knock on the thing, Lily? Knock, knock, knock. Knock, knock, knock. The third little pig peeked out the window, but it was the big bad wolf. May I open the door? Little pig 
Little pig, let me in. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, said the third little piggy. No, put him back in the house. Then I will huff and I will puff and I will blow your house down. Blow the house down, Lily. Oh. Try it again. Blow it down. Blow it down. Blow it down. Leave the chimney on there, buddy. Not yet. Then I will huff and puff and huff and puff. Oh but the brick house was very strong. Inside, the little pigs put a pot of water. <gasps> On the fire to boil. Uh-oh, Lily, it's not looking good for you. You won't escape, called the wolf. And he climbed into the onto the roof and began to climb down the chimney. And then we go look at the, <laughs> the fire. But the little pigs were ready for the huge with a, oh sorry. <laughs> I'm getting too excited. But the little pigs were ready for him. The huge pot of water in the fireplace was bubbling away. Oh. Suddenly, there was a huge splash <gasps> as the wolf fell into the pot of bubbling water. Splish, splish, splish. Hooray, said the three little biggies. Oh, Lily, you have to lie down. You're dead now. Lie down on the couch. Lie down on the couch. <gasps> no. You fell into the pot of water. Oh, no. Hooray, said the three little pigs. The big bad wolf is having a sleep. And then the three little pigs lived happily ever after in the nice house made of bricks. Oh, all right, the wolf didn't get harmed in this one. He was a naughty boy, or naughty girl, naughty wolf. You're never gonna bug the pigs again, are you, Lily? No, all right, say goodnight. <laughs>